Damn. Can you believe this? It's raining cats and dogs. Um, I said the rain has picked up quite a lot. I wish I brought an umbrella. Yeah, the weather app didn't say it was going to rain this hard. At least we're safe here under the bus stop, right? So, uh, going somewhere important? Heading home after work. I, I see. Where am I off to? Um, I just wanted to hit the supermarket. Buy some groceries and whatnot. But I really don't think it's a good idea to go anymore. Under all this heavy rain. <laughs> well, you know what? I guess you're right. Groceries can wet. Oh! Hey! Watch how fast you're going, you jerk! Oh, can you believe those people? They have absolutely no... <laughs> I know they can't hear me, but I just can't help it. I get worked up over that type of stuff. I mean, how can you not be when... Oh my gosh, look at you! I only got some water on my trousers, but... You've taken the brunt of the splash. Oh, what do you mean it's okay? How can you be this calm about it? You think you can go on the bus like this? No, no you can't. You're completely soaked. <laughs> Look at this. Even your hair got a bit wet. Do you want to catch a cold or something? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to sound like I'm your mum, but you did get drenched from head to toe and... Oh. I've got an idea. My home is just round the corner. It's just a short walk down the road. We could probably make a dash for it in the rain. <laughs> Not that it would make any difference for you, since you're already dripping wet, but once we're there, we can work on drying you up. What do you say? Late? Oh, come on, you won't be late. You can just take the next bus. At most, you'll be late by an hour or so. And I've got a phone. You'll be more than welcome to ring whoever's waiting for you. I know I sound like a weirdo right now, but you can let them know that you're safe, that you're just drying off, and then you'll be right home. Oh, come on, what's the matter? Why are you so concerned about arriving home early? Is your girlfriend waiting patiently for you, or... Oh, oh, you're single. Even better. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that's good. So she won't be worried about you since uh, you don't have one. Uh, um, okay, I won't push you any further. I'll go home on my own. Wait, you want to go home with me? Really? Awesome. Okay. How do you think we should do this? Wait, I know. Here, hold my hand. <laughs> yes, grab it. There you go. Now we start running on the count of three, okay? <laughs> you ready? All right. One, two, three, go. Oh, we're finally home. Oh, that took longer than I thought, but you have to admit, it was kind of fun, yeah? <laughs> yeah, it reminded me of when I was a little kid. Running around in the rain with my friend. Not caring about getting mud and dirt all over our clothes and shoes. Which reminds me, we need to get you out of yours. No, no, not in front of me, of course not. We're not that close. Yeah, <laughs> Okay, first, start by taking your shoes off. Go ahead. Don't worry about my floors, I can clean them. There you go. Just put them right there to the side. Good boy. Now, come on, let me show you where the bathroom is. And turn the light on. 
Right here. Come inside. You can take off your wet clothes in here. I'll just leave them on the floor. I'll come in and take them later, and I'll wash them for you. Don't worry, I'll find you something to wear from my closet. <laughs> no, no, not a dress. I've got plenty of other clothes that are unisex. You might want to take a shower while you're at it. <laughs> I think you've got mud in there from the car. Do you want me to show you how it works? I know using other people's showers can be a bit weird. <laughs> yeah, that's my shampoo bottle. I know, it's an attention grabber since it's hot pink, but here, let me open it for you. Give it a sniff. Go on. Do you like it? Yeah. No, no, it's bubblegum and sweet vanilla. Is that too girly for you? <laughs> you should try it. I guess you have no other choice. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, did I forget anything? Oh, there's a fresh towel hanging up on the radiator there. Should be nice and warm for you. Okie dokie, I think that's everything. I'll leave you to it, okay? But just call me if you want anything else. Alright? <laughs> okay, have a nice shower. Hey, are you finished? You've been a long time, darling. You are? Then why haven't you come out then? You're embarrassed. What about? Just wrap a towel around your waist and get out. Do you want me to come inside and help you with it? <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking, of course. Are you self-conscious about how your torso looks without any clothes on? Oh, that's adorable. Hey, listen. I promise I won't judge, okay? Here, I'll back away from the door if it makes you feel more comfortable. Come on. That's it. You can do this. Ah, and here you are. Oh, you do look so cute trying to cover up. What are you trying to hide, huh? Is it those cute little chest hairs? <laughs> look at you. You're getting so embarrassed, which is just making you look all the more adorable. All right. All right, I'll stop teasing you. You know, I've seen a few guys' chests in my time, and I've got to say... Yours is quite nice. Quite chiselled, actually. Do you work out? No? <laughs> it's just good genes, then, I guess. Oh, darling, why is your hair still wet? Did you not dry it properly? <laughs> Doesn't look like it. Come here. Sit down on the sofa and let me take care of it for you. Now, where did I put that other towel? Ah, here it is. I want you to lower your head down for me. That's it. Good boy. It's important to be thorough with this. We can't risk you going out in the cold with a wet head. It's dangerous. You'll catch a cold or worse. Oh, look at this. You have such nice flowy hair. <laughs> it's getting all fluffy from where I'm rubbing it with a towel like this. It feels nice. <laughs> I know. Oh, we can't forget to dry behind your ears now, can we? Tilt your head to the side for me, darling. Just scrub over here. Please let me know if I'm being too rough. Okay? Now the other way. Such a good boy. Always listening to what mummy says. <laughs> Why do you look so surprised? Don't you like it when mummy pampers you? Uh, you guess so. 
No, no, sweetie, you know so. <laughs> yeah, we're almost done, baby. Hold still. <laughs> oh, whoops. Did that tickle you, sweetheart? I'm sorry, darling. You do like it, though, don't you? You like it when mummy tickles your ears like this. Oh, so cute. Okay, lift your chin up. That's it. Show mummy your handsome face. And let's dry this cute little face of yours. And neck. Oh, look at that. Your nose has gotten so red. Do you want mummy to blow your nose for you? Of course you do, darling. Come on, blow your nose into the towel for me. It's okay, mummy will wash it later. That's my good boy. Okay, now you look all dry and clean and <laughs> smelling like bubblegum and vanilla. We should dress you so you can catch the next bus home. Okay, so like I said, I tried to get the least feminine clothes I could find from my closet. So I got this hoodie. And these jogging bottoms. Oh, don't worry, we have other options if they don't fit. Hey, where do you think you're going, young man? No, you can change in front of me. Uh, I will put my hands over my eyes. Yes, I'll promise I won't peek. And since I'm your mummy now, it's not a big deal if I see something, right? No. What do we say when mummy asks you something? Yes, mummy, that's right. Now mummy will cover her eyes and you will take the towel off. And then put the clothes I picked for you on. Okay? Okay. All closed. Oh, hurry up, sweetie. I don't want you to be late for your bus. Can mummy open her eyes now? Okay. <laughs> oh, I had a feeling those would be too short for you. But hey, at least the hoodie fits you. It's nice and baggy, so it fits you perfectly. Um, try these trousers instead. Uh, what are you waiting for? <laughs> okay, okay. Closing my eyes. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're done? Okay, let me see. Perfect. Oh, they fit you so nicely. Oh, you look so handsome. Mwah. <laughs> oh, look, it's only five minutes before the bus arrives. You better get going, sweetie. Yeah, come on. Here, take this umbrella with you just in case. You can come by tomorrow after work to pick up your clothes, okay? I'll make sure they're washed and dried and ready for you. What about my clothes? You can keep them if you want, darling. Hey, before you leave, don't you want to kiss Mummy goodbye? Yeah, come here. Oh, 